Hello everyone, here is uh, the new class link dashboard update. You can see it, but my screen looks a little bit different than uh, what yours may be, but that's because we can do a lot of customizing. So I'm going to start right over here with uh, our, the way we add apps. When I click on add apps, we get a slide over and you can see the staff library and the student library. And if you click on one of these libraries, you can add an app simply by clicking add underneath it. The edit mode has shifted from the top over to the side on the left. When I click on edit mode, I can add a folder, I can change the theme, I can change the app size, and I can change the color palette. So let's look at some of these. So I'm going to take uh, the theme, and this is the classic look. And some things are on the side there. Here's my edit mode. And I can do a primary look, which will use big icons. And I have been using the professional look right here. Um, the app size can be small, default, and large. And the color palette can also change. Uh, right now I have mine set to high contrast. If I turn that off, I can then choose colors. Another big change is the dock here on the bottom. If you like to use apps a lot, certain apps, you can drag an app uh, right onto your dock and it can be right there for you, bookmarked whenever you need it. Um, if you right click on the desktop, you can sort your apps by name, you can add an app or create a new folder. If I right click on an app, I get a lot more choices. I can add it to favorites. Actually, this is what puts it down in the dock. So right there, my dock is a little full, so it slides the extras off to the side. There we go. Um, I can also remove from favorites. I can add this to a folder right away. I can apply tags for further organization. I can even edit the password of this app if it's just a simple saved password app. And there are a few more things like you saw before. That pretty much is the update. Oh, you know what? Over here under our profiles, there's the settings. The settings slide out from the side here and there's tabs across the top. So you can also change your theme here. So like I said, I was professional. I can switch it to classic if I, if I want to right here. Um, I can manage all my passwords right here. For example, this one right here, ACT, that's a saved password. It's not a district one, so I'm going to click on that, and I'm going to click on edit, and I can change my password right here if for some reason I needed to um, for this particular app. And across the top there are some more, like your auto launch. I only have one app launching whenever I log in. Um, and there's a few other things here too. But that is our new class link update.